What's up, Three Pound Nation? We're back. Middle of the day, winter fishing at its finest. It does not get much better than this, guys. We're gonna have a great time. I'll tell you what, it's beautiful. It's winter. That's crazy. Together, and we're gonna put slabs in the boat, no doubt. That's right, guys. It's an absolutely stunner for a, for a winter day. And so, midday, and I, I've told people this for a long time, is that this, this does not matter what time of the day you go out in the winter time. In fact, a lot of times, like we found out this morning, the bite was really tough. That might, might just mean that the bite is really good in the middle of the day. Just one of those secrets of winter fishing, for sure. Let's crank her up. Oh yeah, here we go. This is gonna be good. Now I went fishing this morning and we had a pretty good bait on. So we're gonna go ahead and start with that again. And that bait is the winter crappie hair jig. You guys can actually find that on the website right there. Check it out right there. All fueled by that sniping braid, really super thin. Oh, I get asked the question all the time. It goes straight to the jig. And then of course the hammer 10 cannot be replaced. This thing has got it going on. And all we're gonna do is look around for some fish. Like I said, during the winter time, it just doesn't seem to matter. And in some cases, in a lot of cases, coming out here in the middle of the day, we're looking at uh, roughly around 2.45. Um, you'll find some enormous schools of crappie, I think, coming up, getting warm from that sun and uh, they're usually nicely tight and compacted. There we go, first drop of the day with the winter crappie bait. There we go. First drop of the day. How about that? A nice little pile down there. This is a solid fish too. Boom, right there, that's how you get it started off. I really think what I like about this bait is that it's, its body is made up of kind of a rope material. And it gives off the impression of a much thinner, smaller bait fish. And I think that's the secret of it. So you guys can check it out at the website if you're interested in it. The other technique you can do um, in the winter time, which is really nice, is just a straight up vertical fish. Um, a lot of times these fish will just move very, very slow to your bait. So there I am coming in and we just let it dangle there and these fish just can't, they can't help themselves sometimes. They just have to touch it um, and that's all it takes. There we go. Good fish here, man. Great fish. And we switched it up. Sticking with that idea that that rope on the body of the hair jig, this is called the clown. If you go to the website, it's called the clown. Um, sticking with the idea that the, uh, the rope on the body is making it look thinner and smaller. And I, I think that that definitely plays a factor. And I went with a louder color because I just felt like I wasn't, they weren't being notice, noticing it. Here you go again. There we go. And this is another dandy. I think truly it needed to be louder and more obnoxious. So that's why we've changed it up. Now, excellent fish there. That was probably the biggest. Hammer 10, check it out on the website. There are uh, PTG down there has them. Uh, several other bait stores have the Hammer 10 now. Mid seat, cork handle, sniping braid, the small stuff. I love it. There's something special coming there at sniping braid, but right now I'm using the the optimal, it's incredible. And then of course the clown, and I always supplement it with a number seven split shot that makes it a lot easier for me to see it on the screen. But not only that, it obviously gets down there a little faster. So there we are falling down on that structure. And I do believe they can just see it a lot better right now. Um, that's two quick fish in a row. And three would definitely be a tall tail sign. That we made the right move. There we go. This guy really shot at it. No hesitation whatsoever. And I never felt the bite. I just literally set the hook knowing that he had covered it up. 
but he was super aggressive. And anytime I see that, I'm gonna play the screen and not wait for a bite. With that seven, number seven split shot on that really can disguise a lot of bites. So rather than safe than sorry, especially with a hair jig, I'm setting the hook. Sometimes I give it little jumps here. We got one coming from the bottom. Man, we played that guy to the T. And we're having fun, guys, and that's the key. Having fun. That wasn't the biggest fish, but by golly, that was fun. And we're just rolling around here. All right, guys, I do want to uh, introduce, uh, and we've talked about Windrider a lot this year, but I'm very proud to say that they are the official sponsor for uh, Three Pound Fishing for 2024. Um, you're going to be able to get discounts through three pound fishing all those things So I'm very excited about that and the partnership that we have uh, for 2024 again I'm wearing the Hayward if you want to stay warm this winter check it out. Um, they're sending me some other stuff I can't wait to share can't divulge it yet, but um, The Hayward me and Mike both wear it and it's just fantastic uh, It's an affordable Way to stay warm, but on top of it you can get a discount if you use that three pound fishing code just the same thing three pound fishing that's your code and they'll hook you up so check them out at uh, winrider.com and uh, very proud and happy to have a, a national sponsor like them very proud of that and uh, we're gonna we're gonna treat them right and make sure that they're they're welcome here in the crappie industry especially from three point pound fishing we're gonna help share those new products to you guys so we're looking forward to it but all the other great sponsors are back from from last year um, Cornfield Fishing Gear, um, I can't say enough good things about them as you know. Bait Pop, Original Fish Formula, um, Hog Fishing, Sniping Braid, all, and of course you're going to hear a lot about 3 pound fishing equipment because we're going to continue to grow. We've got new rod lengths coming and so just in general the future is really looking bright for 2024 for 3 pound fishing. We're going to expand all those products even more if you can imagine it. If you go to the website and look where it's at now compared to where it was. Um, it's been just quite the ride and we're going to keep adding products to it. I can tell you that the next rod length that's going to be coming out is an eight footer and um, you'll be seeing that probably come March realistically. So let's get back to it. But uh, <coughs> PTG Outdoors, that's another fantastic one. And, uh, and again, all of our sponsors are fantastic. All right. So we definitely have a school going on out here. These schools will just pop up just about anywhere, but typically if you find one school, you find multiple schools. Um, so if you lose one, you just keep trolling, and typically you'll find another one. And that's a school right there. That's a nice school. Find something these guys really want to eat on. Right there, I'll just drop, stay right on top line of them. Uh, typically, once I start getting any type of movement, I'll start reeling and making sure I'm going in a... Oh wow, he just barely picked it up, guys. Good fish. Good fish. Slab, baby. And we're still rocking that clown, so that's just a big fish. And we let him go here at three pound fishing. Good fish here, guys. Oh, this is a picture fish. <clears throat> Very nice. Picture fish right there, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. There we go. Good fish. Mm -mm -mm. Beautiful. Well, guys, I think that's going to end it. It's kind of a short episode, but I wanted to share what was going on for 2024 in terms of sponsors, but also show you that you can catch these fish any time of the day in the winter time. And uh, that clown hair jig is just popping it right now. I'll tell you right now, that sun is getting. We're ending the most of the day. We're at uh, been out here almost an hour. You know how it is in the winter. The days are short. 
days are short, but I hope you guys have a great holiday season and um, have a great one, guys. Mmm.